Hi guys, welcome back. For those of you who are new to this channel, I'm Cameron. This is Tux the Doberman. This week's video is going to be about my first week with my Dolby and how it's been. Obviously, there's been ups and downs. It's been like a roller coaster. There's been highs and moments where I've really enjoyed the company and his training. And there's also been moments where I've really worried about him, which I'll obviously get into. First of all, let me start off with the more playful side before I get into anything serious. So I gave him the tennis ball less than 10 minutes ago. Look what he's done to it. <laughs> Broke it already. Must have some strong jaws. Hey, Tux, come on, ready? Ready? Get it, get it, get it, get it. Go on, Tux. Go on, Tux. Get it, Tux, get it, Tux. Good boy, get it, Tux. Pull him, pull him. Yeah. Good boy, get it. Yeah. Come on, Tux. Now, let's get into the serious stuff. I'm going to tell you the commands that I've been trying to teach him over the last week. And I'll tell you the one and only big concern that I've had. I'd rather start off with the negative and get it out of the way so we can end pleasantly. So, I'll tell you what I've been worrying about him. As you can see, he's been wearing a neck, donut, ring, whatever you want to call it, instead of a cone. Obviously, I got that one instead because of his comfort. But the reason why I got that is because he's been irritating his ear and sadly, Tux has an infection. He's got an infection on the inside of his ear. I don't know what that is. I don't know if it's down to the cropping, if he's been scratching it, something happened on the journey or if it's the way I did the first bandaging when he first came. I don't have a clue, but when he first arrived here, he had a bit of scabbing and a bit of a, like a yellow pus inside his ear, so I was concerned about him. Took him to the vets on two separate occasions. There was adamant that he had an infection. Now he's got three sets of tablets he has to take and a solution that I have to clean it out with every single day. In medication so far, in this week, I've spent £120. <laughs> so it's not exactly a small figure, but of course... He's not just going to be a, my, my pet and my guard dog, he's an investment for me. So what I put into him is what I'm going to get out in return. So it's for the love in it, I've got to put it in. So because he's got that on his neck now and he's got an infection, I've decided not to do his bandaging. You know, obviously when you get the ears cropped, you have to put their bandage in him for a while. I'm not sure how much you know, but you're supposed to bandage the ear and keep it up to encourage them to start keeping their ears up. Uh, some dogs pick up on it a lot quicker than others but I've decided just to hold fire on that until his ear heals up of course his health is more important now let's get to the more positive side the commands that I've been teaching him at first sit there's a basic command sit I was uh, I was trying to teach him sit for the first couple of days with treats after that he started acing it he's smashing it every time now of course there's Occasionally he does not, he doesn't listen for, for example if we're outside and there's cars going past and there's people around I have to kind of force him a little bit so we're still working on that But in general he's 80% there and I'm really impressed Stay, he's picked up on stay really quick Again he's 80% there, I can tell him to stay one place and he will um, I'm going to give you guys a few examples in a minute I've also taught him quiet and hush or oh, well quiet or shush I uh, tend to use I've been working on speak so them two quiet and speak I'm kind of like 40% there but for the first week you gotta say it's quite impressive I'll show you in a minute and the release command that I'm using is go so when I just want him to go off and do his own thing and not be focused on me I just say to him go and he's kind of got that every single time <laughs> Sit. No, stay. Quiet. Sit. Stay. Quiet, Tux. Quiet. Sit. Speak. Yes, speak. Good boy. Good boy. Sit. Stay. Stay. Quiet. Boy, speak. <coughs> yes. Tux, smell it. Oh, <laughs> I think I'm fine. You're looking white. 
Anyways, to finish off guys, the biggest accomplishment this week has got to be the stairs, without a doubt. From the beginning, he was absolutely petrified as you've already seen in the previous video. If you haven't, I'll just show a quick clip now. But now he is smashing the stairs and I couldn't be any more proud of him. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video, please subscribe to the channel, hit the bell and leave a thumbs up and until next time, over and out.